moving finger on the display is called swipe and friends it's play a very important role in our android device ios device and on nowadays on the pc hello friends you are watching estate mango channel i am your friend ram ke singh and in this tutorial we are going to learn how you can implement swipe in unity for the mobile devices and friends i want to make a request that if you are visiting channel first time so make sure you have subscribed channel and friends i will provide the code in the description box so you can just copy from there and paste on your script so friends i want to tell you that uh, there will be two script first one will be swipe and the second will be swipe test so the swipe script will help you to detect the the motion detect the motion on the your device display so first we will detect and then mobile uh, swipe test will help you to perform the action whatever action you want to perform it may be you perform want to perform the jump it may be you want to perform your motion so it's depend on you what the action you want to perform so let's start to the tutorial and friends don't forget to subscribe and like us it's really help us a lot <clears throat> so friend i have opened my unity and you can see that uh, i have taken one ball and uh, there is one that is a sphere and i have taken cube that is uh, ground so uh, i am creating just game object that is empty and then i am giving name that swap test so it's a just a simple uh, i am just a, i have created the environment so that i can uh, make you understand and then you have to create two script first script that will be your swipe and the second will be your swipe test so swipe i will add on the game object It means uh, on the uh, ball that will be my game object so i will add swipe on the ball and let's see what i have written on the swipe script so friend i have just uh, written all the codes i don't want to write at this time because due to this problem uh, this video will be uh, very long so i don't want this <coughs> so i just want to make you understand everything so let's open it and friend this is swipe script so in this uh, in this script i am just write i am i have written the code to take the input from when you will move your finger on the screen so i have written the code for the your your pc your mobile device so friends you can see that uh, this is my swipe script and this script you have to add uh, on that object where you want to perform swipe uh, when you will swipe so that action will perform on the on that game object so friends i have taken few boolean uh, variable that is top tap swipe left swipe right swipe up swipe down so this is the complete compulsory because uh, there will be two diagonal and they will cross each other so you have to just uh, your cell phone cell phone is like a square and you are just crossing uh, from corner a diagonal two diagonal and they are crossing each other so friend in the update i am just uh, passing false for them because in starting uh, they have to false and then this is my code i have written for the for the pc so you can just understand uh, and uh, dragging is also my boolean variable so this is very simple that when someone will click on uh, the device uh, on the display or it may be someone touch so especially this code is for the pc so you can see that when someone will click the left click then that code will perform and then someone will uh, left or raise the raise the press so that action will be performed so friend this is code for the our cell phone or mobile so you can see that i have written the code when our touch length will be greater than 0 so we have to perform the few condition so i have written all the condition i will provide you all the code and this is not too much difficult so that you can't understand it is very easy you can understand easily and friends when you will 
you so you will understand uh, what's going inside the code and then friend uh, this is the simple code that uh, dragging is a very important that uh, when we are dragging so what action should we perform and when we are not dragging so there will be no any action on the ball so friend this is the magnitude i have chosen i have choose one a uh, random number 125 uh, and it may be any number is greater than 0 and then i am reset uh, i am using the reset function and you can see that i have used reset function so many where because i want that uh, when after the drag my uh, touch should be on the zero position so i am just doing the reset and this is my setter and getter so if you are developer so you can you know very well what is the setter and getter so it's a play a very important role that is the part of the abstraction you know very well oops concept and so, so friend i have added that script swipe script on the ball uh, that is my sphere because that is my object where i want to perform the swipe and then you, this you can see that this is swipe test so swipe swipe test i have written one script that is swipe test and this is the script uh, where you will write your code or whatever action you want to perform on by the swipe so i just want to perform the that uh, i want to move the ball uh, where i am doing the swapping so i want that my ball should be go in that direction so you can see that there is a four condition i know very well that there is four condition left right up down so this is the uh, coordinates that i have defined that you can understand by uh, uh, you can understand that uh, x positive x negative y positive y negative or z direction is also uh, carried there and friend this is the this is the uh, code for to move your ball because player toss from the position means i am just changing the position of the ball in the update method so hope you understand i have added swipe test on the just on the mpt game object you can write this and then i am passing the reference don't forget to pass the reference otherwise your code will not work so i have just passed the player as a sphere and then i am just choosing the choosing the script on the sphere so let's run and see how our code working so just i am dragging you can test on your cell phone you can test anywhere and this code will work work perfectly so you can see that my code is working uh, very smoothly ball is moving so you can apply anywhere so hope you understand uh, this tutorial and if you understand if you uh, learn something so don't forget to like this video and please subscribe us you, here you will get learning tutorials visit to tuto visit visual videos and so on so thank you so much for watching have a good day keep learning